I would like to bring in Stephen Chang. He is, of course, of Kindred Ventures. So good to see good you, to my see friend. You. What have you seen here on the floor that you're saying, I want to invest? You know, it's it's interesting. The, the headlines are about uh, humanoid robots, yeah. autonomy with vehicles. Um, one of our companies, Neuro, announced a, uh, a new product with uh, Lucid and Uber. Yep. So great, uh, robo-taxis for everyone. Um, but you know what's really interesting to me in robotics? It's the pet robots, the pool cleaning robots, uh, all the little robots that you don't have to be fearful of walking next to uh, and that are just a single purpose and they're delightful and they, they help you around the house. We just saw the robot that mows your, well, it's actually a leaf sucker. Yeah. Do they work though? I mean, listen, I'm just gonna say it. We had a demo at the top of uh, Big Money Show yeah. and it was working, it was working, and yeah. then it wasn't working. So ro anything hardware, is dealing with physical limitations, physics yep. in the real world. So the, what's what's really given it a tailwind lately is that AI, computer vision, understanding what's happening in that computer vision and being able to come up with actions intelligently yep. to respond to what's happening, that's gone through 100 exchange just in the last three, four years. And so why you're seeing a, an explosion of robotics out there today yeah. is because of AI. And so AI is giving this physical intelligence, this physical AI that NVIDIA was talking about yesterday. Yeah. It's making this all possible. And they can reason. That's the thing, you guys. We're hearing a lot this time about robots that can reason and can actually make decisions. Yeah. Okay. And so think about robotics as uh, local on-device intelligence and in the cloud models, bigger models being served. Um, uh, and so this inference that's happening is really important. This wasn't possible like three, four years ago. Today it is, and that's why you're gonna see a first wave of really clunky first attempts. But the second wave, they'll iterate and they'll, it'll only get better from here. So don't worry, you'll be able to have robots that uh, work 99% of the time. Steve, great to see you. I know you're a busy man. Thank you so much. Great to see you. All right.